Welcome back to Three Hidden Fertility Blocks. I'm your host, Bridget Danner, owner of Joyful Mamas, a pregnancy success program. Today's video is called MTHFR Blues. Firstly, what in the world is MTHFR? MTHFR stands for methyl n tetrahydrofolate reductase, and it's a gene on one of your chromosomes. And its job is to make an enzyme of the same name. If there is a slight mutation in that gene, then there will also be a defect on the enzyme that is produced. This gene mutation is related to potentially many health issues, but we are concerned with those related to fertility and fetal development. You may have recognized the word folate and the MTHFR name. You may know that you should be getting enough folate to prevent birth defects. Natural folate is different than synthetic folic acid, which we'll learn more about in a minute. If you have a defective MTHFR gene, you're not going to break down folate very well. Folate is a critical in sperm production and in the maturation and implantation of your fertilized egg. It also plays a part in the development of your placenta. So what can you do about it? One is that you can get your MTHFR gene tested, and we can help you order that test through directlabs.com. Two is you could take methylated folate in a methylated B complex. This differs from folic acid supplementation. You want to check the label that your B9 is in the form of methylated folate, not folic acid, which can build up in your bloodstream and lead to other issues. And three is you can be aware of which foods are high in folate, such as sunflower seeds, asparagus, sprouts, and dark leafy greens. For more information, visit our speaker Nicole Hardim's website, thehealthyelements.com, and search the word folate. This concludes our three Hidden Fertility Block series. We hope you learn something new and get ready to learn a lot more from our 15 experts in our upcoming Joyfully Pregnant Summit. See you then.